you have to be committed. But if you're committed, I mean, the process works. We've seen, you know, our business. I mean, we started off in a in the back of a 20-foot enclosed trailer. That's where we started. You know, now we're in a 50,000 square foot facility. Uh, we do training modules. We're we're interacting with, you know, 40 or 50 different state agencies and federal agencies, you know, across the country, across the globe. So, you know, if you're committed to it and you'll put the time in it, you know, the, the program's there. It will work. Hog Eye Cameras came about as we, we saw the need for a live feed video system when you're trapping. What that does is that allows you to um, target your catch to catch more of the sounder. That's the family group of pigs. That's the, the goal was to catch the entire sounder, no matter what trap you're using. The, the information that you get from a live feed video, it just, it can't be, uh, it can't be touched with steel shots or with, you know, manual triggers, the old style. And so, you know, it, what it does is it, it makes you a better trapper and it also, you know, allows you to see what's actually going on with the landscape. We both were forestry. One of us had a wildlife background, the other one had an IT background. Neither one of us knew about marketing. So we were able to interact with, with some uh, marketing folks and that led us into Bricks to Click with the uh, Mississippi State Extension Service, Dr. James Barnes. He came in and kind of, you know, showed us how to develop a marketing plan, how to develop a Facebook page and interact it with, you know, websites, what to put on your website, what not to. You know, that, that program through the Extension Service and working with Dr. Barnes and he introduced us with some other, you know, some other guys with Extension and, and some publications and, and just, uh, you know, moving towards a true marketing plan where you had different types of social media, websites, print media, uh, I mean, all the way back to our email marketing campaign when somebody drops into our sales funnel. I, I, we had no idea what a sales funnel was, but you know, now we know lead magnets and sales funnels and how all that stuff plays into keeping your product in front of a potential customer or your customer. Uh, you know, once you land that customer, you want to stay engaged with them. You, you want to, to keep that flow of information because you know, this, this market's changing. The information is changing, they're still doing research, and so once our customer has one of our products, we want them to be successful. So we continually, through the programs that we learned with Bricks to Click, send information out and, and create that interaction to just keep that customer base interaction interacting with our, with our customers and our website and social media as much as we can. You know, when we started first working with Hog Eye, it was to just get their message clarified. So we went through a process to help them create a marketing message so that customers would listen. And that was to get them the attention they needed online. And so they implemented that into social media, but then they also wanted to do that with a website. So we helped them wireframe a website, create a, you know, content ideas and a production uh, system for them to, to do that. Once they started doing that and they started receiving dozens and dozens of emails from potential customers, then they also decided, well, we've got to have something on the email marketing. So how do we do this? Well, then we had to create other kinds of content, help them, you know, lead them through that process. As they kept doing that, they kept getting more and more attention on Facebook and Instagram. And then that has led to more and more development of the products that they sell. They were only selling the camera that fit on top of the hog trap at the very beginning. Today, they manufacture traps. Uh, not just the camera, but the trap too. And they've moved out of a small facility here in Crawford, Mississippi, or in Crawford, Mississippi. And they're now in a school that they recently purchased here locally that's 50,000 square feet. So, and every part of that operation has grown as a result of the early work and sales that the Hog Eye Camera has brought to that company. So it's been tremendous in terms of the growth and, the, and how fast it has happened for them online. Hog Eye Camera System was going to be a, uh, lack of a better term, a side gig. It was not going to be a full-time profession for, for me or my partner. We were just something we were going to do. And our goal was to, to 75 to 100 cameras a year was what we wanted to manufacture. Um, you know, now there's months that we do 75 to 100 cameras per month. So the growth, um, you know, is, is, I mean, it's exponential. And, and once, once you get that ball rolling, 
as far as that growth and with the social media, it just continues to grow. It kind of feeds itself once it really starts rolling. You know, for, for hog eye cameras and in reference to bricks to clicks, they're here to help. Uh, you know, that's our that's our support mechanism for a small business, whether you're a farmer or whether you're, uh, you know, like us in the camera business. The the extension of, in Mississippi is just a you know it, the the amount of information is there, and they're willing to help. You just have to ask for it.